the field has changed as, as different perspectives have, have come in and certainly a female perspective is very, very useful. I actually don't think, people have made the argument that, that maybe it's because the field is sexist and, but I don't think that it's that. I think that it is truly, truly uh, an example of your, your personal biases, you know, like I, I am personally biased in how I ask my questions. But if, but if I'm in this field and then there are, there are men who are asking their personally biased questions of the field, then together we will come up with something that's going to give us a more complete answer. Same thing as, you know, I'm also Latina, right? And so as a minority, I also have a different way of looking at things that, you know, other people may not have. Like, for example, you know, the fact that I am, I am really outgoing and I'm, I'm not shy talking about sex and, and, you know, copulation and things like that. Somebody who comes from a different culture may find that, you know, a lot more difficult to do. And so I can come in and I can fill that gap, right? And that's the beauty of having diverse perspectives in science is that everybody comes, we all have them, our personal biases. But if we give room to enough people with those different ideas and those different backgrounds, then overall science is going to be better. And so that's, that's really the cool part of the story, I think.